Hey guys, how are you guys doing today? I'm Joe Coronado with Crown Financial and uh, thank you for joining me today guys. Uh, I have some great information for you guys today and I hope it makes uh, total sense for everybody. Like I said, my name is Joe Coronado with Crown Financial and um, my contact information is 956-357-0445. So if you do like this information that we share with you guys today and it piques your interest, give us a call and see what we can help you with. What I'm gonna do today guys, I'm gonna share with you guys uh, three different reasons people purchase and um, we also have uh, another uh, some a few gentlemen coming in to help us out help me out I guess share some information with you guys that is really really interesting guys what I want to share with you guys really quick is that we all uh, that are in sales understand that people purchase uh, many reasons but the three major reasons that I see the most and this is of course my opinion is that we see people purchase on something called emotion and that could be something that um, they graduated, they feel that they deserve this gift, or they had a loss in the family. Uh, a lot of emotional ties, so people purchase off of emotion, that'd be one. Or trying to keep up with the Joneses, that's another emotion that people you know, purchase. Um, the other reason would be logic, and logic probably makes the most sense, and people purchase when it makes sense. And what we've noticed is that people enjoy their purchase more when it makes sense to them. The last one is pressure, guys. If you've been in the business and sales for more than a year, two, three years, uh, you, you're a professional. And you start learning tactics on how to put pressure on people. Uh, I'll give you an example. Buy now, limited time offer, blowout sale, all these different tactics. And you put this pressure on these individuals and they end up having buyer's remorse and people didn't understand why they purchased. So what we want to do is get logic behind a purchase. That's really important to us. Never mind the pressure. And the emotion is something that wears off. So logic is what makes most sense to people. But what we understand is that sales reps or professional advisors or salesmen, all one and the same, consultants, whatever you call yourself, at the end of the day, you're a salesman. And it's very important that you explain uh, to people the services that you offer, the explanation of services. So today I brought in somebody to help me out, guys. And like I mentioned, uh, I'm with Crown Financial. That's my business, guys. I'm a broker. So I offer a variety of products uh, that help families and, of course, um, that will help you reach your financial goal or reach the coverage goals that you're looking for. More importantly, guys, this gentleman here has been working with me for quite some time. and He's a good buddy of mine, and he's coming in today to share a little bit of information. Uh, his name is Roy Gonzalez. Roy Gonzalez, come on in, bud. You Thank, you, Thank, Thank you, Joe. Thank you, Joe. Thank you. Hey, guys. How are you doing? My name is Roy Gonzalez with um, Hosea Financial Coaching, working on the umbrella of Crown Financial. And I really appreciate it, Joe, for no inviting problem, me here bro. today. And so, folks, what I want to ask you today is if what you thought to be true about money turned out not to be, when would you want to know? And so today we want to share some things, some, some, some tidbits and nuggets about some of the stuff that we do that we help our clients do and so right now uh, I'm gonna turn the screen over to, uh, I'm gonna show a little video and we're gonna I'm gonna talk about it and so I'm gonna go ahead and turn the turn the camera to the screen right now All right, so right now, um, if you look on, the, if you see on the screen, it says the three types of money. We have accumulated money, lifestyle money, and transferred money. So what I wanted to share today was uh, these are the these are all the areas that money is being put away or being spent in your circle. Okay, so the first circle I want to talk about the first pie is accumulated money. Okay, accumulated money is money that you're saving, that you're saving right now in an IRA, in a 401k, um, and maybe in a, a, a SEP if you're a business owner, right? And so most advisors would tell you, you know what, come invest your money with me and I'm going to give you a better rate of return. And that might be true, however, that's going to take more risk to you. And who wants to take more risk when we're living, I mean, imagine... Remember what happened in 2008 when the, the housing crisis happened? A lot of people that had money in their 401ks lost a lot of money, okay? The second type of money is called lifestyle money. And this is the part, this is the type of money that you do every day. This is how you pay your car payments, your mortgages, your, 
you're going on vacations. This is your fun. This is everything you do, your bills, your lifestyle, okay, as it says. Now, some advisors will tell you, you know what, if you want to earn more money, if you want to save money, then cut your lifestyle. Now, how would you like it if I, if I told you, hey, Mr. and Mrs. Client, um, all we have to do now is get rid of your favorite car and don't take that vacation next year. I mean, how would you like that? No way, right? And so what we do here at Crown Financial and is we focus on transferred money. Money that you're spending already unknowingly, unnecessarily. This is money that we're gonna find you already in your lifestyle, in your budget. We're gonna find you money that you're spending already and we're gonna recover those money. We're gonna teach you strategies on how to recover those monies. So those are some of the things that we do here um, with Hosea Financial Coaching, working with Crown Financial. We would love to help you, okay? And so I'm gonna turn it back over to, to Joe. Hey guys, I hope you guys got the information and it made sense to you guys. And uh, I really think Raul touched on a lot of things that are really important that most people don't think about. But we also notice that we miss a lot of people when we share this information with folks. And uh, what I mean by that is we miss people because most people that, well, a lot of our viewers, some of them don't speak English. So we also have them in Spanish. So this is where I cut the video into Spanish, guys. So buenas tardes a todos. Uh, les quiero explicar una poca información hoy. Uh, en los servicios que ofrecemos, somos una agencia que ayuda a las familias. Y, y a los individuales, ¿verdad? Ahora tenemos un señor que los va a ayudar a explicar la misma información que Roy tuvo la, la, la oportunidad de explicarles. Él se le va a explicar, uh, en, más que nada les va a ayudar a entender un poco más cómo trabaja este sistema en español. Ahora tenemos el señor Judiel Barba. Judiel. Yo, ¿cómo buenas, estás? Muy, muy buenos bien, días. Amigos. ¿Cómo están? Muy buenos días a todos ustedes. Uh, como dijo yo, mi nombre es Judiel Barba. Soy asesor financiero. De, de, de la compañía es, es importante que el día de hoy estemos platicando con ustedes para decirles el manejo del dinero en esta ocasión les vamos a platicar qué hacemos con el dinero qué hacen las gentes con el dinero de qué manera llega el dinero a ustedes de qué manera es utilizado y de qué manera es gastado hemos diseñado para eso un diagrama que nos podrá ayudar a darles mejor, a que puedan ustedes tener mejor información sobre cómo podemos manejar y, y qué es lo que estamos haciendo con nuestro dinero. Si me permiten, pasamos a ver nuestro diagrama. Como les comentaba a todos ustedes, durante mucho tiempo nosotros hemos trabajado en este análisis sobre qué hace el dinero con las personas. Y aquí podremos eh, poder identificar un poco más qué hacemos. Nosotros le hemos puesto tres tipos de, de, de dinero, o tres momentos distintos del dinero. El primer momento es cuando acumulamos la riqueza o el dinero. Normalmente el dinero es percibido, percibido por todos ustedes, por su trabajo, por algún ahorro que tienen, por algún dinero que han guardado durante algún tiempo. Todo este dinero nosotros le hemos llevado cuál es el dinero que acumula una familia o que acumula una persona. Otro momento importante del dinero de una familia o de una persona es el estilo de vida. Todas las personas, todas las familias tienen un estilo de vida, un estilo de vestir, un estilo de comer, un estilo de divertirse, un estilo de entretenerse. Este factor es muy importante, que es el que día a día vivimos todos nosotros, es el que también genera una parte importante de nuestro gasto. Y el tercer sector, que nosotros hemos denominado la transferencia de dinero, ¿a dónde va nuestro dinero? Normalmente, nuestro dinero en, en grandes cantidades se va pues, a pagar la casa, a pagar los impuestos a pagar los vehículos que nosotros tenemos, a pagar una infinidad de cosas que muchas veces no están bien organizadas, no están bien estructuradas. Nosotros, durante este diseño que hemos vivido, 
hemos visto que en este punto mucha gente puede ahorrarse dinero, muchísima gente puede tener ahorros importantes que le permitirán tener un mejor estilo de vida y que le permitirá, permitirán tener un mayor dinero acumulado o dinero ahorrado. ¿Para qué? Para tener un futuro más seguro y un futuro más tranquilo para, con todos nosotros. Nosotros en esta empresa hemos diseñado distintos métodos para tener ahorros de dinero. Es importante que se comuniquen con nosotros para que les podamos ayudar a organizar, a reestructurar todo su dinero o todos sus pagos para que ustedes puedan tener un mejor estilo de vida y puedan tener una cantidad de dinero mayor para un futuro. Si me permiten. Escuchando la información todos, ojalá que sería algo que les, les interesó y vamos a seguir continuando con estos videos. Además de eso, les quiero pedir muchísimas gracias al señor Roy por estar aquí con nosotros hoy. And again, guys, I want to thank everybody for joining us. Thank you, Roy, for being here with us today. Thank you. And also, thank you, Judiel, for being with us today as well to share the information. Before we get out of here, guys, I just wanted to share our information. If you guys want to contact us, if you have questions, comments, or concerns, or it's something that you want to learn more about. Like I said, my name is Joe Coronado. The business is Crown Financial. And our phone number is 956-357-0445. That's my direct contact. So if you want to get in contact with me, you can contact me there. Directly to the office is 956-230-0585, guys. Hopefully we can help you guys as well. Roy. Okay, guys. Uh, again, my name is Roy Gonzalez with Josea Financial Coaching. My number is 956-655-7630. And remember, guys, what we want to do... This is, these are some of the things that the transferred money, the government, and the financial institutions are not telling you. And so what we would like to do, if, if we can save you tens to $20,000 a year in lost money that you're spending already, unknowingly, unnecessarily, is that a conversation you'd like to have? And if so, give us a call. Okay, give us a call, 956-655-7630. Thank you, guys. This is Judiel, guys. Again, thank you, Judiel, for being with us. Muchísimas gracias, Judiel, para estar aquí con nosotros. Ahora, Judiel les va a pasar la información de él. Si sería lo que ustedes gustarían contactarlo a él directo para más información. Ok. Muchas gracias, yo. Gracias por la oportunidad de, de llegar a todos ustedes. Decirles que actualmente es, más impor es muy importante que sepamos qué hacer con nuestro dinero, que sepamos cómo manejar nuestro dinero. Es verdad que a veces... Tenemos ingresos y se nos van como si fuera agua entre los dedos. Nosotros les estamos ofreciendo eh, esa información, esa asesoría, ¿para qué? Para que ustedes puedan manejar su dinero más profesionalmente sin que pierdan su estilo de vida. Quiero agradecerles nuevamente, mi nombre es Geudiel Barba y quiero darles mi teléfono que es el 956-246-7586. Muchas gracias por su atención. Thank you guys. Bye. Until next time, guys.